Hi, I'm Miriam and welcome to Miriam's Manor. Happy Christmas in July, you guys. I have another product review video that I am doing to celebrate Christmas in July with you guys. And I am going to be putting a carnival together this year for my Christmas village. So I wanted to go over some of the pieces with you guys to show you what they have available. Now, it's fun to get all those moving pieces that are animated and make noise and light up, but it is also just as important to get some of those still pieces and focus on the accessories. For anyone who knows me and the way that I village that's been following me, the biggest thing that I always talk about is setting the scene for each area of your village that you are creating and your accessories definitely help you do so. So I wanted to go over actually three of them that I have today that I think kind of can be grouped together to make a really cute set. So this is the Lamax Tin Can Alley. The first thing that I wanted to go over with you guys is Lamax and the way that they package their products. These are all packaged very nicely. On the outside, it has a thick cardboard box with a flap close. And then as you open it up on the inside, you have very thick and sturdy styrofoam inside. So with this little flap here, we'll just lift that up so that we don't rip this piece here. And look at how cute this is. And this is all in here, very organized. There's a compartment in the styrofoam for each of the figurines and all of the little pieces that go along with this piece. I love that this already comes with three figurines. The gentleman who looks like he is the operator or the worker for the game, the actual kiddo playing the game, and maybe the sister who is watching along. And this also comes with these cute little fences that you can set up right in front of your tin can alley. So you can show him kind of like behind the lines shooting. Isn't this so cute? Such a cute little game to add to your carnival landscape. Now, one of the things that I really want to bring to your attention on the side of the game are the different prizes that you can win that they have and the cute little different stuffies. The reason that I love that is because this figurine has the exact same animals looking like they just won a prize at the Tin Can Alley. So let's go ahead and open this one up. So when I have an accessory package from Lamax, I keep these because I repackage my figurines back in them. So I open them very carefully and just gently pull them apart so that I don't damage this outer hard plastic because I definitely love to keep these. Now, one of the other things that I do, let me take these guys out so that I can show you. On most of Lamax packaging, it comes with a little picture description of what the item is that goes back in this package. So it's very helpful to keep this little slip when you are repackaging your items at the end of the Christmas season. However, I do notice that this is not typically attached, it's loose. So all I do is take my stapler and staple this to the plastic so that I will always have this picture as a reference as to which figurine goes back in this package. And look at these guys, they are so cute. They absolutely look like the big winners at the Tin Can Alley, and I'm definitely going to make sure I show them leaving the Tin Can Alley game as I set them up in my Christmas village. And there is another carnival set that I really like that you can buy this year for your village. It's these little guys. Again, the little girl is hanging on to a teddy bear and the little boy has a balloon, which definitely is appropriate for any carnival. So let's pull them out of the package. 
And this is such a cute one with the parents, with the kiddos on their back, the cute little teddy bear that the little girl has just won. I love this. When my kiddos were little, we took them to the fair, and this is exactly what me and my family looked like with our kiddos on our back as we were giving them piggyback rides through the fair and carnival. So this is a super cute figurine. And then all of them together make such great figurines for a carnival space. The 10 can alley is about four and a half inches tall by about six inches wide. You can find it on eHobbyTools.com for about $17.09 as of July 25th, 2021. Now this set here is called the prize winners. You can find this at ehobbytools.com and other Lamax retail distributors. ehobbytools.com right now has this piece on sale for $7.19 for all three pieces. You can also search the item number, which is 92776. This little group is called Coming Home from the Fair. You can find this on ehobbytools.com as well as other Lamax distributors. As of today, July 25th, 2021, eHobby is selling this item for $7.19. And to find it a little bit easier on their website, you can search the item number of 82582. So I hope this video has given you a little bit more information on what carnival accessories to use. Also giving you a little inspiration so that you can go ahead and start planning early for your 2021 Christmas Village. And also, I just wanna make a quick comment. One of my subscribers, Veronica, has some pieces for sale. They are Heartland Valley pieces from the Dickens series, and she has three of them available for sale. So if any of you are interested, you can email her directly at this email address below, and she will be glad to go over the prices and pieces with you all. So until I see you again, stay safe, God bless you, and happy villaging. Bye.